cover story. And my dad got into some trouble with some bad people. And we were in danger, so Rafe and I had no choice but to go into hiding. Why did you just tell me? I wanted to. I wanted to, but I, I couldn't. For my safety and for yours. Okay. So that's why you told me you were going to take care of your mother. Why the hell did you tell me you were using me? Because, because you kept telling me that you wanted to visit me in Mexico. You know how we could make it work? I had to make sure there was no doubt in your head that, that our relationship was over. It was the only way to make sure you weren't going to get hurt. And then the threat was gone. And, and, and Rafe was able to take care of the men that were after us. So it's gone, is it? They were put behind bars. Okay? And the minute that I realized my family was safe, I came here. I came here to see you. I thought you'd be happy that I was back. I guess I just never imagined you'd be in bed with great grandma Kate. With Trask out of the office, uh, no official charges have been filed, and since the courts are closed, I can't get you out on bail. Not tonight, anyway. I'm so sorry. It's okay. We know you tried. Yeah. Thank you, sweetheart. For everything. Yeah. You can thank me when we bring you home. I I didn't know what to say. I, I felt really weird about it. Clearly, I read the signals wrong, which is something that I always do, and... Charlie. I'm sorry. You were emotional about everything with your parents and your grandparents, and I just thought... Anyway, um, I'm sorry. Charlie. Uh. Charlie, stop. You have nothing to apologize for. I was glad you kissed me. Really glad. Well, Abe, I'm, uh, I'm flattered. I am, but, uh, Belle and I were going to have to go back to Hong Kong at some point, so, uh, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to take the job and then, you know, then end up having to go back and leave. Let me see. Sorry to hear that.